Other, bigger parasitic wasps have totally lost their wings. You can find them on many a British heath. This one, Methotcha, looks rather like an ant, and insects that live by hunting ants easily mistake it for one. The tiger beetle is a very active ant hunter. It chases them and runs them down. And very successful it is. Earlier in its life, of course, as a larva, a tiger beetle can't run around. Instead, the larva catches ants by waiting in ambush. It plugs the entrance to its burrow with its armoured, plate-like head. If an ant touches that, it's as good as dead. It works every time. Methotcha, however, is a more awkward customer. The beetle larva is waiting with jaws agape. But Methotcha is more agile than the usual ant and it manages to slip out between the beetle larva's jaws. It grabs the larva's soft body and pulls. And now it stings it. Mathotcha climbs out of the tunnel, waiting for the poison to take effect. The sting has only paralyzed the larva and the wasp drags the helpless creature farther down its burrow. Now she lays her egg onto it. To prevent anything interfering with her grub while it stays underground, feeding on the paralyzed beetle larva, she blocks up the entrance. This is the longest and most laborious part of her motherly duties. But now, without any more work from her, her young will have all the food it needs to develop into an adult.